Hey guys, it's me, and I haven't posted a YouTube video in like three months, so I figured I would post one today. So, basically this is going to be a get ready with me story time. Uh, well, first let me just start off, I'm not giving you all no foot pics, but my, <clears throat> sorry, I'm like kind of sick. My, um heel is currently sprained or broken and because i jumped off stairs does not sound like there's something in it but it doesn't come out okay anyway and i had to leave school early because i couldn't even walk so yeah and when we went to the ortho they said it wasn't broken but it was probably just really deeply bruised because of how i can't walk on it so that's fun <clears throat> But anyway, I it is like four, five o'clock, and I'm getting ready. I don't know why, but yeah. So we're gonna start off with our dew drops, and here's the story. Whoa, okay. And ba so basically, I was in fifth grade, and I'm sure if my friends are watching this, they probably would know this by now. And basically, I did not like my fifth grade teacher. Like, at all. Like, I did not like him. And a lot of my classmates knew that. And there was this specific kid. I'm not going to say names because her mom is a lawyer. And she might sue me. And basically, she would always, like, gossip, basically. But she wouldn't gossip. You know, it's not, she wasn't gossiping, but she was, like, spreading rumors, and she's really, really dramatic. Luckily, she doesn't go to my middle school. She goes to the other one that my school feeds into, so that's fun. Um, and basically, her name, we're just going to call her Patricia for this video. I don't know why, but we're going to call her Patricia. And basically, Patricia had this thing with this kid named we'll call him hold on i'm brainstorming james yeah so patricia had this thing for james like not a crush not but they basically were enemies basically because they were both super smart or something like that and they would always fight and whenever my fifth grade teacher would put them in a group with each other um they would like be like i can't be in a group with him and he would and my fifth grade teacher would be like oh well like what the sigma but anyway so back to what i was saying i hated my fifth grade teacher and i hated this girl patricia but we were kind of friends i guess kind of but I'm not trying to spread rumors. That's why I'm not saying her name. But basically, she knew I did not like Mr. Kurt. Basically, everyone in my class knew I didn't like Mr. Kurt. Guys, I accidentally just saved her, said his name, so I'm going to have to edit that out, I think. Oops, guys. But anyway, everyone in my class knew I didn't like this teacher. But they would never say anything, luckily. So I thought I was good. Until this kid, Patricia, she found out that I didn't like Mr. Kurt. And the first thing that she did was tell... Oh my god, I said his name again. Was tell... This teacher... That I didn't like him. Like, why, Patricia? Like, if you, if I told your teacher you didn't like her or him, whatever, like, you wouldn't be happy. And you would throw a whole tantrum about it because you're dramatic. Anyway, but, like, it just doesn't, I hate it. And then he, it was, like, the last nine weeks of the school year, and he knew I hated him. And that really spiked our relationship so good. We already didn't have a good enough relationship because I did not like him. Like, I was excited to get him at the beginning, but then I wished I was just never in his class because he traumatized me, honestly. 
And I mean, I just hated it. It was terrible, like actually. So basically that's it. Come back if you want another story. I think I'm gonna post another video. Basically my after school routine. No, JK, I'm not gonna post that video. Not yet until my uh, heel feels better so I can actually do everything. But I'm gonna post another video. I think it's gonna be my skincare collection story time i guess i don't know you're just gonna have to wait right now i'm using some healing ointment from CeraVe because it's literally so good like a lot of people don't think to put healing ointment on their lips but it's literally for cracked dry and chafed skin so like what yeah 